Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, in today's video, we are going to continue our discussion on the syllabus for semester one uh, courses for BA Honors Economics. So in case you are new to my channel, uh, hi everyone, I'm, my name is Poonam Kumari. And uh, in this channel, I specifically make videos related to statistics, mathematics and economics. And I try and cover various things related to this subject regarding what are the syllabus, what are the different different exam uh, strategies could be, how to prepare, how to prepare for different different kinds of exam. So if you are someone who might be interested in all of these domains, please consider subscribing to my channel. And uh, if you have some requests for me to make videos on, uh, please let me know in the comment box. I'll definitely keep it in mind. Uh, before making the videos uh, next okay so okay let's start talking about the syllabus for uh, mathematical methods for economics so in our previous video we talked about how to go about uh, you know studying the introductory microeconomics course so course ka structure kya hai what are the weightages that are given for different different chapters what are the reference books that you have to refer similar things we are going to talk about uh, the course which is mathematical methods for econ economics so ye course uh, jaise uh, all of us can see that your syllabus has changed from now on uh, specifically if we talk in terms of delhi university syllabus so so specifically for mathematics jo aapki course book thi wohi rahegi jo last time thi the chapters have changed a little bit. So what are the chapters? What is going to be the reference book? And what could be the general approach that you could follow to uh, tackle this exam? We'll talk about all of that. So let's start. Okay, so we are talk talking about uh, the syllabus for MME. And uh, guys, before moving on, you have to be very, very clear that from this year's onward, jo BA economics course hai, it has become separate. So there is an honors course, there is a major, there is a minor, and there is also one uh, major and interdisciplinary course. So kindly note while following this video or syllabus, ki aapka exact course kaun sa hai? Are you doing an honors course or major or minor? So jo bhi hum major discussions kar rahe hai, they are with reference to the honors course. And uh, if there is some course which is similar for the other courses as well, I will definitely mention it, okay? So let's start uh, talking about, so we talked about the introductory microeconomics course in the last uh, video. If you have not seen that, I'll put it uh, somewhere here. You can just check it out. And now let's start to talk about our second course, which is Econ 002, which is Introductory Mathematical Methods for Economics. So in the last year, for all these years that we've studied economics, this course is our uh, tha, Delhi University mein, aur aapke first semester mein hi tha, and this time also it has remained okay so your course name is econ 001 introductory mathematical methods for economics so when you go to semester two you will have intermediate mathematical methods for economics so the level will keep on adding up so for this particular course what is going to be your reference this is going to be your reference book the name of the book is Sitzetter and Hammond, uh, Z 2002 edition. This is what you have to refer. So this is the exact name of the book, Mathematics for Economic Analysis, Pearson, 2002. This is going to be your book. So usually, your second course will be mathematics related. Jo bhi course hote, mostly, mein ye book hi refer ki jati hai. And it's a good book. It's a book that you can also try and do on your own. So if you are someone who likes to read through physical pages, you can buy the book. And if not, there are some, uh, you can take it online, some copies available, things like that. And Kafi Jagai readings are also available in most of the Xerox shops and colleges. You can do that as well. So what is going to be our syllabus? The exact syllabus is going to be, so the syllabus is very, very simple. Uh, not many complications. So from this particular book, you have to start doing chapter number one to nine in its entirety. Matlab, pure ke pure chapter, there's nothing that you have to skip. Only if some portion is written optional, even in the book, that you might skip. But uh, rest of it from chapter number one to nine, you have to do everything entirely. Okay. 
so the so there is not uh, so it's not very difficult ki, okay is chapter mein se ye nahi karna hai is chapter mein se ye nahi karna is tarike se there is not going to be much complications here so so we have to do chapter number 1 to chapter number 9 wo chapter ke topics kya kya hone wale hain so the first unit is going to be preliminaries meaning starting ke basic basic topics so introduction mein so logic kya hota hai proof kya hota hai basic cheeze regarding sets ये सब आपके डिस्कशन uh, में होने वाला है एंड देन फ्रॉम सो यूनिट टू इट्स गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट फंक्शन ऑफ वन रियल वेरिएबल सो फंक्शन ऑफ वन वेरिएबल को इलेबोरेट करेंगे फिर पॉलिनोमियल फंक्शन क्या होते हैं पावर फंक्शन क्या होते हैं एक्सपोनेंशियल फंक्शन क्या होते हैं तो फंक्शन अलग अलग टाइप के उनके ग्राफ्स उनसे रिलेटेड प्रॉपर्टीज वो सब आपको पढ़नी है देन फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर फोर ऑनवर्ड्स वी विल स्टार्ट टू टॉक अबाउट डिफ्रेंसिएशन सो सिंगल वेरिएबल डिफ्रेंशिएशन फिर डिफ्रेंसिएशन रिलेटेड और भी टॉपिक्स डिफ्रेंसिएशन का मतलब क्या होता है वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ लिमिट वॉट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ कॉन्टीन्यूटी वॉट आर डिफरेंट डिफरेंट थिंग्स वेन डज अ सीरीज कन्वर्ट सीरीज डाइवर्ट ये सारे टॉपिक्स हम लोग करने वाले हैं सो कॉन्टीन्यूटी डिफ्रेंशियबिलिटी लिमिट्स ये पूरा का पूरा मेजर चंक होने वाला है एंड द थिंग दैट मोस्ट पीपल रेड ऑफ जो थोड़ा सा डिफिकल्ट भी होता है that starts from this particular chapter so chapter 4 onwards so chapter 1 2 3 are still manageable after chapter 4 ek to bahut uh, things are new so that's why also people feel ki okay this is something new and many people also are not very comfortable with mathematics so these are the chapters that you have to be very very careful for and uh, so uske baad again there is a revisiting of exponential and logarithmic function and then uh, uh chapter 9 also talks about single variable uh it should be optimization guys it should not be differentiation Sing single variable optimization so function of one variable ko agar aapko optimize karna hai mane maximize karna hai ya minimize karna hai then how do you go about it all of those uh topics are going to be covered here so uh, it's very easy to remember so your book reference book is going to be Sit Sitter and Hammond, a uh, two thousand and two edition. So you have to do all the chapters starting from chapter number one to ten. Okay. So now how to approach this? Basically, uh, so you can start reading up the book. Uh, there are multiple examples also, so you should definitely do them. And after every section, there are exercises. So her section ke baad exercises hain, jisme questions move on based on the difficulty level. So you can start from the basic and then move on. एंड मोस्ट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन एट दी एंड जो बहुत ही हर एक्सरसाइज के पीछे बिल्कुल एंड वाले जो क्वेश्चन होते हैं दे आर लिटिल डिफिकल्ट एंड लिटिल हाई लेवल क्वेश्चन सो इवन इफ यू आर एबल टू रीच द इंटरमीडिएट लेवल इट्स फाइन सो सो दैट्स हाउ यू कैन गो अबाउट इट यू कैन स्टार्ट प्रैक्टिसिंग फ्रॉम द एक्सरसाइजेस एंड बिकॉज ऑल दो सो दिस पर्टिकुलर कोर्स विद द न्यू काइंड ऑफ सिलेबस एंड न्यू इंटायर प्रोग्राम इज फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम दैट इज हैपनिंग बट बिकॉज आपके पहले कोर्सेज जो होते थे उसमें भी ये कोर्स था ऑल दो थोड़े बहुत चैप्टर्स एड सब्ट्रैक्ट हुए हैं सो यू कैन यू यूज दैट ऑल्सो एज अ रेफरेंस कि एग्जाम में किस लेवल के क्वेश्चन आते हैं सो दैट कुड ऑल्सो बी a reference for you to understand the level of paper but kindly note they are not bound to follow the pattern that they used to because wo pehli bar course offer kar rahe hain they can uh, and although uh, so they can change the pattern as well and uh, jaise humne pichle lecture mein baat ki thi regarding the microeconomics course every unit was given specific uh, you know weightage uh, no such thing has been done here सो so, यहाँ पे बहुत ही क्लैरिटी नहीं दी गई है कि इस यूनिट से इतने मार्क्स का पेपर आएगा इस यूनिट से इतने मार्क्स का पेपर आएगा लॉर्ड ऑफ क्लैरिटी हैज नॉट बीन गिवन बट द मेजर चंक इज गोइंग टू बी फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर फोर टिल दी एंड सो ये आपका मेजर चंक होने वाला है स्टार्टिंग का पोर्शन इज अ लिटिल इंट्रोडक्टरी पोर्शन एज वेल सो दैट्स वेर यू शुड फोकस मोर एंड मोर ओके सो या आई थिंक दैट्स अबाउट इट सो Uh, very simple to remember also chapter number वन to नाइन entirely आपको पूरे के पूरे chapters cover करने हैं and uh, guys one more thing I want to say because it's not a course that you can okay do कि मैं एक बार ही ये course पूरा कर लेती हूँ and then I can just get done with the mathematics so please remember the economics course is full of mathematics तो आप एक तो ये core paper अपना maths का करते ही हो 
एंड ओवर द टाइम यू रियलाइज कि जितने आपके कोर्सेज है इवन माइक्रो होगा मैक्रो भी होगा धीरे धीरे दे हैव लॉट्स ऑफ एलिमेंट ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स सो इट्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट यू स्टार्ट टेकिंग दीज थिंग वेरी सीरियसली बिकॉज आपका पूरा इकोनॉमिक्स कोर्स यू नो इट्स हेवीली डोमिनेटेड बाई मैथमेटिक्स और यही सारी चीजें हैं टाइम एंड अगेन दिल स्टार्ट कमिंग एंड दिल कीप कमिंग इन योर डिफरेंट डिफरेंट कोर्सेज सो यू शुड डेफिनेटली पे अटेंशन एंड कीप योर कॉन्सेप्ट स्ट्रॉन्ग इन टर्म्स ऑफ द मैथमेटिक्स पार्ट बिकॉज uh so right now you can somehow uh, you can pass your paper and things like that but when those concepts will start coming in and then you like okay ye to maine kahin padha tha ab mujhe yaad nahi aa raha hai many of uh, the students face these challenges so since you have come into the course so starting se hi you can uh, be wary of this fact ki mathematics kafi hone wala hai economics course mein so you should start doing it very very seriously even from the starting okay so i think that's it for today's video and in my next video i'll start uh, to talk about the syllabus for statistics in details uh to uska course kya hai uske weightage kya hai different different units and all that so we'll talk about that so i hope uh, you were able to get some value out of this video if you did please consider uh, subscribing to my channel and uh, let me know if there are any other topics that you would like me to make videos on i'll definitely uh, keep that in mind so till we meet again take care and have a good day thank you so much